Now from the Netherlands, Jonas Le Grand from Öko Moderne. Please welcome him. Hi, um, I'm speaking on behalf of Joris van Dorp, who's a member of the Eco Modernists. He wasn't able to come, and my name is similar enough that I'm speaking in his stead. Um, many people have spoken about how what Germany is doing is the wrong decision from a climate and health risk perspective. Uh, I'll just start with a bit of good news. The debate in the Netherlands is shifting. It's no longer a question of yes, no nuclear energy. Sources close to the government are saying that the parties are negotiating about how much nuclear energy. Will we have four or eight reactors? But there is a point where uh, everyone in the climate debate, uh, people who are in favor or against nuclear energy all agree on, is that you need rapid action, that action in the near future is more important than action that is farther away. And that is why it makes no sense that while we have these plans to build new reactors, uh, Germany and Belgium are closing their reactors, which are, for the large part, perfectly fine carbon neutral powerhouses. So, again, this is again why we are coming here and we're asking Germany, reconsider your decision, listen to the arguments that have been made today. Uh, this is a mistake. There is always a a way to change, maybe not this year, but maybe in five years you can restart the reactors. I also uh, want to give a sh shout out to uh, the Leszek from Poland. I really agree with what he said. There are no silver bullets. You know, there is not a single solution. Renewables is not a solution in itself. Only nuclear is not a solution. And even degrowth, while it has some good arguments and idea, is not enough to save us from the climate catastrophe. We need an eclectic and pragmatic approach to this. Kernenergie, ja, bitte!